Hey, Dr. Chagall here with the Express Chiropractic, and I want to show you a super important exercise that'll not only reduce the pain in your upper back and your neck, but also will help strengthen your upper back and neck, which can help improve your posture as well. So here's what you're going to do. You're going to stand against the wall with your heels about six inches from the wall. Now you're going to put your, your rear end and your upper back flat against the wall. And now you're going to also put your hands, your wrist, and your elbows flat against the wall. Go up as high as you need to go to get everything flat against the wall. As you begin to slide down, your goal is to keep every part of your body that we've discussed, your upper back, your rear end, your hands, your wrist, and your elbows flat against the wall as you slide your elbows toward your ribs. What you will notice is you'll probably notice that one of your hands or both will start to come forward, which indicates you have restrictions in your shoulders and in your upper back. So as you pull and slide down, try to go just as far as you can go to where your wrist and your elbows and your hands stay against the wall and hold it right there for six seconds and then slide back up to give yourself some relief. And then you're gonna slide down again as low as you can go. And as your hands start to come off, just force them back against the wall and hold that for six seconds and then slide back up. You're gonna repeat that six times in a row. You are going to feel the tension back here between your shoulder blades. If you do, that's completely normal. That is where you should feel the tension. I want you to do that six times, hold each one six seconds, do your other stretches, and then come back and repeat it again holding it as tight as you can. And once you're good at it, you're gonna look like this while you do it, where everything stays pressed against the wall and nothing is pulling away from the wall. It's a really tough exercise. It's really effective. Good luck, and if you have questions in the office, always just feel free to ask. If there's any unusual pain, of course, stop the exercise and check with us before you continue it. Dr. D, over and out.